Hey, how you doing? You, right there. I'm talking to you. Um, hey, I hope everybody's okay. I'm just uh, back from the gym. That's why the hair is wet and I looked look so glowy and happy. Uh, it's time for another weekly update, so let's get to it. Uh, as far as the digress stuff, uh, the guys went to check out the place where we're gonna record the drums. Uh, they sent a, a nice video clip to, to the rest of us. It looked good, it's a big, big place and looks like it's exactly what we need. Uh, Nico is still working on um, nailing down the dates. I don't think they, they've settled on anything yet, but that's coming along. The guitarists are pretty much every day nailing down riffs, you know, recording the demos, doing proper demos and, you know, nailing down everything, you know, as far as arrangement and composition goes. Henry in, in Helsinki is working on the solos. He's, uh, he's getting those out. I'm here uh, in Prague practicing. Um, I went to the karaoke on Tuesday. I got to do a lot of singing. Unfortunately, there was a guy who was uh, smoking uh, here in Prague, you know, smoking in bars is, is still legal. It wasn't like terribly smoky, but I, I was definitely feeling it the next day because uh, on Wednesday I was uh, supposed to do a new uh, cover video for YouTube. But, you know, my voice just wasn't there. You know, I'm not used to that smoke. I'm out of practice, I guess. I haven't been hanging out in bars a lot lately. So, on Wednesday, I was like, okay, it's not going to happen today. Let's try tomorrow. On Thursday, I was going to do this song that requires really, I would say, vocal acrobatics. And, you know, my voice did not want to cooperate. You know, those, like, tricky, high parts were not just they were not just gonna happen so I went for plan B and I did the dream theater cover one more dream theater cover right well uh, I love the new album and uh, I did the song uh, gift of music that was a uh, single they released for the new album and you know what it, it came out pretty good even though when I was doing the song I could feel that my voice was kind of on the edge and I, I had to kind of keep it together but I don't think you're gonna hear it when you listen to it so so that's good. Uh, it's been getting, uh, it's been actually getting a nice amount of views on, on YouTube. Uh, hey, if you guys want to help me out, you should probably share the video if you like it. Please do that. Uh, I mean, it would be nice to get more people to see the stuff. And, you know, hopefully maybe even through those videos, you know, find uh, die crests and, and all that stuff. So we can always use more people who like us, you know. Isn't that what we all want deep down? People to like us strangers to like us right so you know if you could please uh share the song uh, i'll put a link down there for you guys if you haven't checked it out it's good do it seriously uh the camera microphone by the way didn't like that <laughs> um i've been playing a lot of guitar oh uh, actually what i did is uh I bought a new guitar. I actually, I can show you guys. This one, it's really cool. S series, seven string. I got a shiny strap for it. It's really shiny. So I now that I have two guitars, I down tuned this by half step. So I've been playing Guns N' Roses. It's been a while, you know, because it's always a pain in the ass, you know. I like the like locking tuner, uh, floating bridge guitars. So if you want to play a Guns N' Roses tune, that means that you have to, you know, detune, uh, down tune the whole guitar, and it's a huge pain in the ass. So I never did it. So now that I had a spare, I down tuned it, and I've been playing a lot of, you know, rock and roll guitar. It's pretty cool. Uh, there might be even a video coming up, you know, where I play a little bit of guitar. It might. Let's see what happens. Uh, I've been playing with the new band, you know, we found a bass player, he's gonna join us next weekend for the first time, we're gonna check him out, I hope he's good and I hope he's interested, we're still looking for another guitarist, a lead guitarist, uh, if you know somebody, let me know, put me in, in contact with them, you know, uh, for the time being, I'm gonna try and play guitar while I sing, but you know, it's not optimal, but I'll, I'll do it as long as I have to to move things along with the new band so we can, you know, maybe play some shows and, and you know, I can get some some 
more uh, gigging experience here in Prague. Um, so that's been happening, playing a lot of guitar. Uh, I'm looking for a studio space, you know, uh, me playing guitar and singing at home. And it's only going to get worse when we go, you know, get closer to the recording of the album. I'm going to have to sing a lot more. I have to get used to singing like eight hours a day, right? And the only way to prepare for something like that is to sing eight hours a day. Otherwise, you know, you're, you're, you're not going to have the stamina to do that. Uh, so I'm looking for a space. Fortunately, here in Prague, they're quite cheap. You know, you can, for a very reasonable price, let's say 60 to 80 euros, euros a month, you can, you can find these uh, sellers. Uh, I just, you know, I would prefer if mine had internet connection and, you know, bars in the window so people don't steal my shit. So I'm looking into that. I have a place in mind, but the owner is out of town. So he's going to contact me when he gets back. So I might be building my own little rehearsal space slash studio here in Prague soon. So that's kind of exciting. If you guys have any ideas uh, as to what cover songs you'd like to hear, you know, shoot me a message, uh, put a comment on the video. Uh, share the videos if you if you like them and um, I'll see you guys in the next video then rock and roll <laughs>